If I get uh, a few 20 slot bags, is that enough slots? Listen. It's, it's time for you to be let out of the nest. And I'm happy to do it. I'm happy to, to help as much as possible, as much as is needed. But a really important step is becoming independent, is being able to look at these systems and evaluate them and make up your own mind. Again, I'm happy to help you as much as possible. And I will continue. And honestly, 20 slot bags actually are enough. In my opinion, 32 slot bags are a really big luxury. For example, I'm feeling a little bit of inventory pressure right now with a mixture of 20, 18, and 24 slot bags. However, once I get a few more slots, I think I'll be absolutely fine. And I honestly could be fine even like this if I managed it a little bit better. Um, so that's the answer to the question. But at the end of the day, um, I think that, you know, there's a lot of complicated things that are in the game. And we need to be in a position where we can look at them and evaluate what's going on and make up our own mind. And you've got this. You've got this, man, I believe. I think you've got that, you know, you're a smart guy, you're in chat talking, you're eager to learn. Um, and it's time, it's, time to, it's time to evaluate things. If you need help or advice, I'm happy to give it. Always will be. This is, this is not me saying never ask me anything um, in game ever again. But we should change the way we're giving advice. It needs to be more like, how can I determine if this is enough? Right? Like, why is this enough and this isn't? Right? We must learn to fish rather than just eating the fish. That is also, uh, that is also a big thing as well, actually. Um, if you make a mistake, okay. It's not a big deal. It's not, it's okay. Right, and, um, honestly, you know what? Hmm, maybe you should just do something wrong. Look, should we do it together, guys? Let's make a, let's make a bad decision. We have our Lunaria, Circle of the Sun. I'm actually gonna dump every single Sin Ring. I was actually saving these. So, I was actually saving these rings up because I was gonna salvage them all and generate a bit of revenue because uh, we can use an Ascended Salvage Kit to get Stabilizing Mages. Actually, make turn a nice profit, actually. But you can see here that we have a vendor price of four silver, 95. And maybe I'm a new player and I don't know this. And I'm not aware of the system. So I might just go ahead and, they're taking up my inventory space. I don't want to do with them. Well, here we go. Vendor, gone. Gone, 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 gone. And these items, which are actually great for my mech, and actually a lot of other characters too. Gone, 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 gone. And the the reason I've done this, just to reiterate, is because the game... I, I haven't destroyed myself here. This is a mistake, obviously, and I've lost value, and, uh, you know, the, I could have done this much more efficiently if I had known better. But it's okay. Um... We can recover from this. That's not a big deal. We can get our trinkets and rings, but they'll, they'll drop again. That's not a one-time quest that we can't replace that item now. You know, it's not like a unique thing that we can never obtain. We can get it again. Right? Um, that's okay. We can do more fractals. We can do more open world to get ascended stuff. We can get drops from raids. We can craft new gear if we want to. And we can farm more gold. And... Being okay with making mistakes and not being paralyzed by being afraid of doing something just a tiny bit wrong. Oh, oh no, I did something a tiny bit wrong. The world's ending. It's an apocalypse. Don't worry about it. Right? You're going to make a mistake. It's going to happen. You're going to make mistakes. Um, and that's fine. Right? There's no long-term damage. And you don't have to feel bad about it. You know, if you're having fun and you're blasting, doesn't matter if you delay yourself by like 10% or if you're playing 10% wrong or even 20% wrong. Honestly, no, it doesn't. Leap in there, have some fun, don't worry about it. You know what? Let's go further. You know what? Oh, I'm actually, I'm inflicting my chat with pain right now. Let's go further. This is a classic. Who, okay, admit it. Who did this on launch? Who sold their res? Who did this? I bet a lot of you did. Here we go. Let's sell them all. Or oh, let's sell the unidentified gear too. Yes, let's go. Let's nuke all of it. Boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. Or oh, sell the exotic too. Oh, that one hurts a bit. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> let's go. 
<laughs> See, now that's pain. Now that actually is a little bit pain, okay? <laughs> But again, like I said, this is not really going to cause a lot of long-term damage. Or, or it, none. It causes nothing. This doesn't matter. It does not matter. And this is true of all things in Guild Wars 2. Oh no, I used my currency wrong. Oh no, I bought the wrong item. Oh no, I learned the wrong skill early on. It doesn't matter. You'll learn all the skills eventually. Yeah, you'll get your gold back. You'll, you, know, you can always farm in a meta event the next day or in a week's time. All right? You can do another fractal. You can do another raid. When you're learning Guild Wars 2 and you're getting into the game... Just get in there. Don't be afraid to make mistakes. Don't be paralyzed and, you know, face this choice paralysis where you don't know what to do, right? You know, you don't need to validate perfectly every single decision that you make. Maybe you waste some gold. I'm not buying back. Just so everyone knows, you know, you know just in case this ends up on YouTube, I'm not going to buy this and back. I'm not buying this back. No, that's gone. That's gone. That is deleted. I am not buying it back. And yeah, I did this for one person in chat. Because it matters. One person in chat matters to me. I'm um, someone who's struggling and wanting to learn and wants to get into the game. Yeah, that matters to me. And I want to help. I want to help people be more comfortable in the game and have more fun in the game and not be worried, not be worrying about stuff like this. And, you know, not be super stressed out about putting a foot wrong and doing this thing incorrectly or, or, you know, not having this super precise navigated path through this, like, maze. Guild Wars 2, it, it is a maze, but it's a comfy maze. And in different areas of the maze, there's, like, a nice nice tree over there, a swing, maybe a garden, a nice water fountain. It doesn't really matter what route you take because you can always go back to where you started and you can always visit all the, uh, you know, all the attractions within this theme park maze thing. Um, there is no way to, like, hard lock yourself out of stuff. You can't do it. And, well, even if you do, if you, like, delete an item that uh, you get from, say, a collection or something like that, if you contact support, they'll sort you out and you'll have to get it back, right? Um, even if, oh, you know what I should have done? I should have done Blackline Salvage Kit on the greens. <laughs> Should we buy it back and do that? <laughs> that would be one of the most unhinged things ever. That would be so insane to do that. I think it's time. Yeah, I'll go one step further. Let's do it. Now that I've thought about it, I'm going to do it. We're going to get these rares back. Oh, wait, no. I, let's no. No, let's do it on like blues or something. Actually, no, we've got to go full unhinged. Full unhinged. I'm going to do it on blues. Oh. 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 Ah. <laughs> and we're, we're not even identifying them, man. <laughs> that was, uh... I wouldn't recommend doing that. I really wouldn't. That's... That is not the play. But there it is. <laughs> but look, I am giving all of you exposure therapy, right? Okay, to, you know, meme a psych term there real quick. I am getting you used to it. Get used to it. Embrace it. Embrace not doing it perfectly. Embrace just playing the game and having fun, right? Do it! That is my message to all of you.